All right, we're back at the Island House Triathlon, the Invitational Island House Triathlon. This is Bahamas with Bob Terenzo Pizzoni. <laughs> You okay, are going to Money Island, baby. <laughs> That's pretty cool, huh? Yeah, really looking forward to it. I kind of wasn't sure what, what to expect coming over here. Um, I, yeah, I didn't, oh, I guess I didn't back myself that much. I uh, signed up for Miami 70.3 last weekend just, 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 just in case, yeah. <laughs> just in case this weekend was going to be a flop. Uh, but yeah, I'm, I'm having, a, having a great, great couple of days. Yesterday was, was pretty tough. Um, today, again, <laughs> Really tough. Uh, the enduro race, a swim, run, bike, swim, run, and uh, yeah, I guess that that strength endurance training really paid off today because uh, managed managed to uh, hold hold pretty even that second swim and bike. So I think I'm sitting in about third place, uh, maybe 40 seconds behind Richard Murray and uh, 10 seconds behind Cam Dye. So. Yeah, all in all, I'm I'm really happy to be mixing it with those those fast guys. I was gonna say it's such a cool format. You got the ITU guys, you got Olympians, all these different characters from I Iron Man and 70.3, and you get to mix it up with these guys. A lot of these guys you might not have even raced before. Uh, this this is a really cool format. It's, it's great. I mean, to meet Richard Murray and Mario Moller. And, You've uh, met those guys before. Uh, no, 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 I've never met. I mean, I met uh, met Mario for for a minute up in Spain when I was training there with Jan. Yeah. Um, yeah, uh, Richard's a great guy. Aaron, I uh, know who he is, but never really met him. So, yeah, it's great to meet them. They're all they're all really cool guys, and uh, it's uh, Luke. Luke's done a great job putting on this this race. It's it's a cool format, and and it really balances out the the competitiveness. Yeah. Um, gives gives us long course guys a chance to be competitive over over the shorter distance. You know, I think a lot of the uh, a lot of short course guys are probably going. I thought Terenzo was an Ironman guy. Where's he's got some? <laughs> this guy's got some wheels. I mean, you really. Yeah, that's right. Who's I, your daddy? Who's your daddy? Who's your daddy? Who's baby? your daddy? It's right. It's the T man. <laughs> the T man is taking all you fast guys down. You're nothing. I mean, when we saw you in Kona, right it, it, before the race, you're you seem like you're like you're sweating. It just didn't seem like uh, you you didn't seem like you were on. Right. This seems to me. I mean, it's like this brought you alive. You're 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 really racing well right now. Yeah. I mean, yeah, the speed yeah. is there. Uh, yeah. I mean, I I, re I really enjoy this fast hard stuff. Probably don't do enough of it through my career. I but, was gonna say. But I uh, I, I also enjoy the, the long distance stuff. 70.3 racing in particular. Yes. Yes. Ironman. I I would love it if I can just get get that distance right. I think I do have uh, the capabilities of doing it. I think it's just gonna take a little time. Um, <laughs> I was looking at my Twitter last night, and Greg Bennett sent a sent a message saying, "Terenzo, I've been telling you for 10 years you should have stayed to the short course. You never told me that. You might have thought that, Benno, but I would have loved to have had that advice." <laughs> <laughs> but what's great about this is you get to see. I mean, like you said, you've been doing strength training. Did the speed surprise you? Because you're flying. Uh, I mean, I'm, I'm going really well on the bike. My sw my swimming's going really good. I've uh, I mean, doing a lot of training with with Jan Fredino and Nick Castle, yeah. and uh, in a long course pool as well. So so my swimming, I'm I'm really happy with where my swimming's at. Uh, coming off Ironman, I think my biking strength is really good. It's I, I I think biking is probably more of a strength sport than a than a speed sport. Yes. Um, and running, I I'm definitely missing the top end. Uh, my running legs just just haven't really felt there today and yesterday. But uh, I think the the strength that I have is carrying me through the race. So tomorrow, the worst that happens at top ten, you got ten grand sitting there, right? That, that buys a lot of stuff for for, for little ones. It's uh, it's funny how it goes. Uh, I mean, yeah, a couple of days ago, you asked me, I, was, I just wanted to make the make the cutoff for the top ten, but uh, now sit, sitting on the on the podium spot, it's. I mean, yeah, I I. I re Gonna give give my everything to recover this afternoon, and uh, give my everything out there on the race to to uh, finish on the podium. Maybe maybe maybe, uh, maybe close, win this thing. Sixty k close to the top of the podium, maybe. I love it. <laughs> T always thanks so much for for being such a class act, and it was really fun. You're a racer. You're a guy who loves to race, and you just come love alive it. with something like this. You can see see thanks. the sparkle in your eyes. You're coming around that barrel, going, this guy is where he should be. Stay away from that long course stuff. If Bennett didn't say it out loud, I will. <laughs> thanks. Stay here. Thanks. <laughs> Bob, thanks a lot. Thanks everyone for all the support. It's uh, yeah, I mean it's been a tough year, but but uh, having having everyone's support is uh, me means the world to me, and uh, yeah, it makes me just want to do all that better and and uh, help put on put on a great show. This this Island House, uh, yeah, Island House race that, that Luke McKenzie's putting on, and uh, the help of Mark is uh, Mark Holowasco yes. is uh, is yeah, a great initiative, and I'm just just thrilled to be a part of it. Great format for the sport. Yeah, it's it's cool, and I think the uh, the media coverage is going to be going to be really exciting to watch. Uh, been getting a lot of feedback out there. The guys are saying, hey, it looks horrible for you guys, but it's it's really exciting to watch. Love it. Terenzo Opazoni has been our guest. He will be on Money Island tomorrow going for the big $60,000, $500,000 totals. We're at the Island House Invitational. Hold on, everybody. We will be right back.